Hello! When choosing a chicken breed, there are lots of things to consider. Are they a match for my climate? Will they get along with my other birds? Will they meet my needs for eggs and meat? Also, looks often play a factor as people want a variety of birds. Another area where people often opt for some variety is egg color. Chickens lay eggs in a range of colors, white, creams, browns, blues, greens, pinks, speckled, and more. In today's video, we'll discuss blue eggs, why they're unique, and introduce you to 17 different chicken breeds that lay them. Welcome to the Hobby Farm Guys channel. I'm Brian, that guy there, that's Steve, and our techno whiz Eric is busy with the knobs, dials, and buttons behind the scenes. Make sure you let Eric know you appreciate all his hard work by clicking that thumbs up button. You can go ahead and do it now so you don't forget because you're going to love today's video. Right? Who doesn't love blue eggs? Considered by many to be the most beautiful, most stunning eggs in the egg basket, blue eggs, while not rare, are relatively uncommon. In America, most of us are familiar with typically easy breeds to find like the Americana, Cream Leg Bar, and Easter Egger and have heard of other breeds like the Aracana and Whiting True Blue. But other blue egg laying breeds are quite rare, at least in the US, including a stunning land raced breed from Scotland that only recently made its way to North America. Or how about the Dongsheng, a Chinese chicken with black skin, legs, organs, and bones, but which lays blue eggs. We'll talk about them all, but first, let's explore the science behind blue-colored eggs. Now, we never expected to become geneticists when we started this channel, but you almost have to be to understand all the amazing traits and quirks of so many different hobby farm animal breeds. Well, we're still not geneticists by any means, but here's what we've learned about blue-colored eggs. The blue-colored eggshell originates with an ancient but harmless endogenous retrovirus in the domestic chicken. Hundreds of years ago, a chicken got a virus, and the viral DNA was inserted into the chicken DNA. The retrovirus doesn't make the chicken sick, but due to the location it latched onto, it turns on the biliverdin import gene, called usain, in the wrong place, in the shell gland and oviduct of the hen. Biliverdin C33H34N406 is a chemical, a breakdown product of the hemoglobin that gives blood its red color, and a component of bile salts. Biliverdin is what makes bruises turn bluish green as the blood is broken down. Biliverdin in turn breaks down into bilirubin, which results in the yellow coloring seen in bruising and jaundice. Biliverdin isn't supposed to be in eggshells, but due to the usayan gene hiding in the DNA of affected birds, the white calcium carbonate shell that forms inside the chicken is able to chemically absorb biliverdin, a bile pigment that turns those white eggshells a beautiful shade of blue. Unlike brown pigment, which is added as a coating during the final stages of shell formation, the blue is present and absorbed by the calcium carbonate from the beginning, leading to an entirely blue shell, inside and out. Depending on the concentration of the bile pigment, the coloration can range from bright, bold blue to pale ice blue and every shade in between. Smaller eggs and those laid first in a brood are usually more intensely colored than larger eggs or those laid later in the nesting cycle. Also, this usayan gene is dominant, so a single copy will result in blue eggs. However, studies have identified that birds with two copies of the gene lay darker blue eggs than those birds with only a single copy of the gene. So, let's take a look at those chicken breeds that carry this gene. And we'll start with the Americana. Originally derived from South American breeds of blue egg-laying chickens, they have been their own officially recognized breed since 1984. Friendly and docile, they're available in a number of color varieties and lay 150 to 200 large blue eggs each year. Next, the Aracana. With origins in Chile, Aracanas are one of the oldest blue laying breeds. Prominent ear tufts and a complete lack of tail feathers make this breed recognizable. Excellent foragers, they're difficult to breed. They lay 150 to 200 medium to large blue eggs a year. Number three on the list is the Easter Egger. Easter Eggers are not a breed, but a hybrid. Typically, an Americana or Aracana will be used to provide the blue egg color gene, but the other bird can be anything. As such, their looks will vary greatly, as can their egg color, ranging from blue to green, even pink. 
These birds are good layers, producing 200 large eggs per year. Several of the breeds we'll talk about in today's video are forms of Easter eggers, designed by a specific hatchery and given their own fancy sounding name. Next up is another breed that has exploded in popularity recently, the cream leg bar. An auto-sexing breed, meaning young chicks can be easily sexed, they're not only excellent foragers, but excellent layers. Inheriting their blue egg gene from Araconas using their development, these birds lay over 250 large blue eggs a year. Which brings us to the next breed, the Whiting True Blue. Originally developed by an avid fisherman seeking better feathers to use for fly tying, this breed has no set feather color pattern, so you'll get a beautiful variety of colors and patterns. You can also expect 250 to 300 large blue eggs a year from them. Next, we have the Arkansas Blue. An experimental breed being developed at the University of Arkansas, these birds are being bred from crossing leghorns and araconas. The white and true blue just discussed came from similar crossings, but the two breeds are considered different and distinct. Layers of 250 to 300 medium to large blue eggs a year, this breed is still being refined by breeders, as thus far, they tend to be considered rather ornery, and as such, they're not widely available. The azure blue is next on the list. Another hybrid, this robust and friendly bird developed by Hendrix Genetics has silver white feathers and lays about 250 to 300 large turquoise blue eggs each year. Steel eggers are a proprietary hybrid offered through Meyer Hatchery. Developed for looks, the blue tinted or splashed hens sport crests and beards. These birds lay 150 to 200 blue to green eggs with an occasional tan colored egg just for fun. Sapphire Jewels are another designer chicken. Developed primarily for high egg production, these hens can lay over 300 blue eggs a year. With no set feather color, you can end up with a mix of appearances in your flock. The Opal Leg Bar is the next breed on our list. This hybrid was the result of mixing multiple leg bar breeds together. Opal is in reference to their feather coloring, a barred lavender color that makes these birds a popular option. Hens lay 175 to 225 blue eggs each year. Super Blue Eggers are another hybrid. And while we don't know the specific breeds used to create it, we do know that due to their genetics, there's a 1 in 16 chance that you end up with a chicken that won't lay blue eggs. Normally, these hens lay 250 to 300 large blue eggs each year. Which brings us to the Lakeside Egger. Another designer breed developed to combine popular characteristics of some chickens with blue eggs, this breed is not only calm and cold hardy, but sports beautiful barred plumage, crests, and beards. Oh, and they lay 200 to 250 medium-sized blue eggs a year. Next on the list, we have the Lushi. Significantly smaller than other breeds, these chickens of Chinese origin only reach about 3 pounds at maturity. They come with a range of feather colors and lay about 100 blue or pink eggs each year. Another small Chinese breed that lays blue eggs is the Dongsheng. Like Am Samani chickens, they have a fibromelanistic gene that makes their feathers, skin, muscles, and organs black. They lay around 100 small sky blue eggs a year. And from China, we head to the Netherlands, where we find a Dutch breed, the Scheindelar. A long-tailed chicken breed, these docile, free-range loving birds lay 150 to 200 blue to light green eggs a year. Next is an old landrace chicken from Scotland. Shetland hens trace their origins to Spanish galleons that ran aground in Scotland almost 500 years ago. Some of those boats carried chickens with the blue egg gene. These Spanish birds bred with local Scottish chickens to produce a breed with unique traits, including a taffet, or tufted head feathering. They lay around 200 small green to blue eggs each year. And last, but certainly not least, comes the Fibro Easter Egger. Another hybrid, this chicken carries not only the blue egg gene, but the fibromelanistic gene as well. This gene results in extreme pigmentation. As a hybrid, coloration can vary, but skin, legs, and lobes will all be solid black. And these beautiful birds will lay 200 to 250 turquoise blue, olive green, or even rose-colored eggs a year. So there you have it. All about blue colored eggs and 17 different breeds you can find to supply you with those blue eggs. We hope that you enjoyed the video and found the information useful and entertaining. We also hope that you'll support us by subscribing to the channel. 
It's super easy. Just sign into YouTube and click that subscribe button. And it's free. If you're looking for more information on these breeds, check out our Chicken Breeds Spotlight playlist. We've highlighted many of these breeds in spotlights, and we have more of them on the way. Another good reason to subscribe and click the notification bell so you get notified when those types of videos drop. Thanks for watching everyone and happy hobby farming.